Hey guys, welcome back. Kyle here with another little surprises, really. Anyways, Thanksgiving this past is uh, Black Friday. Black Friday weekend is still here. So I've been out and about spending a little money. I thought I'd do like a little trio of things that, you know, I like to do. So I know if you guys are watching, most of you guys probably like doing this as well. So what I'm going to do is give you a little reveal of my past submission through PCGS. I went out and bought some scratchers. We'll be doing that. And we'll rip a couple of these boxes open. Maybe just one. I don't want to make this too long of a video. But, you know, we'll see how it goes. So I want to start off with uh, some of these coins I previously, previously submitted to PCGS. And just kind of give you guys a reveal of what I got. Most of these, I know what they are. They're the... Uh, 2021 20, Morgan and Peace dollars. And oh, and the designer reverse proof set. So, starting with this one here, this is the 2021 S uh, Silver Eagle reverse proof. And I got a 69 on that one, man. I don't know how they do it, but there must be a microscopic flaw, a nano flaw. And they give you a 69. So that was that one, and I think that's probably the type one, and sure is. I also got a 69, a 2021 West Point. Man, I don't know which one's better, man. This one, I think I like this design, maybe because it came out first. But a lot of people like the type one instead of the type two. You hear a lot of comments with the, you know, the, the wing not showing, you know. Oh, well, that's what it is. Maybe in a few years or whatever, they'll adjust it. Oh, I had two sets submitted that in that submission. I got a 69 on that, 70 on this one. Well, you look both coins, they look the same to me. Oops, sorry about that. This should be a type one. Sure enough, it is a reverse proof 70 from the West Point Mint. There's the mint mark. Look at that eagle. Heraldic Eagle with the 13 stars. I really missed that feature, man. They should have squeezed that in into the Type 2, but it is what it is. We're not artists. And here we go with the uh, 2021 Peace Dollars. You know, I, back then I ordered a, you know, I think, I forgot what, what the household limits were, but I think I was there or, or pretty close. Maybe I ordered like six each, I think. Anyways. This was uh, 200,000 or so minted. I really like that. I prefer the Peace Dollar over the, the Morgan sometimes when I look at them, man. And of course, yep, got a 70, guys. About a two dollars $300 corner. Uh, the designer edition, man, I forget what they're going for, but in a 70, I think they're the three dollars $400 range for the set. This one here, I can't see the mid mark. It looks like the CC Privy. Beautiful coin, man. Got that, you know, the other side of the tinfoil look. The dull side. There you go. Look at that. And MS70. This is just a regular submission. I submitted these after, you know, 30 days and I had opened them up. So. You're not, I'm not going to get a first strike designation on these. But I did submit some for first strike. And I did get them, but I'm just going in the way they came. Oh, here we go. Here's a 2021 old privy mark. And that does have the first strike designation. You see that old privy there? And the uh, MS-70. And I get, you know, these... these uh, Prior submissions, I just mix them all up sometimes. So um, I put all the nice ones in one case and all the ones that didn't get, you know, the 70s and another one. But this is the V75 2020. And I submitted a few of these. There's a preview mark. <clears throat> yep. Just a regular submission. No gold shield, no first strike, but still a beautiful coin. 
I got to proof 70 on that. Um, I think I already sold one of these, but yeah, like I said. Oh, no, I bought this one on eBay. Boy, I got, you know, in that FOMO mode, and I paid. I paid a little for this one, I'll tell you that much. I got it on eBay, and this was the um, Carson City. I mean, I had to have at least one. So, yeah, I did get the first day of issue on that, and I think I paid close to four hondo on this one <laughs> so had to have it anyways i think that's pretty much the whole set and it's a mix you know i get them all like uh regular submission first strike designation and then i buy some this is another o and that's regular label came back at an ms70 man i'll take it all day and then there's another one. What is that? The San Francisco Mint Man. That thing is so tiny. That Mint Mart. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. MS 70, 100th anniversary, man. What else we got here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What is that? The Denver Mint Mart. This one I submitted uh, right when I got them, along with the, my other first strike ones within 30 days this is a 2021 denver this is, was the hardest one to get on a 70 and booyah booyah 2021 denver pcgsms 70 man i've seen these things at first strike with the flag label 17 1800 bucks man and with the low mintage of 175,000 for these compared to to the 2023s the value just went up so i like that and what do we got next? Ah, I'll just show you the grade. Another 2021 with the Carson City Privy MS70. You know, my wife criticizes me for Oh, here's another one on the first strike. I need to organize it, these a little bit better. Put all first strikes together. And, and just the regular label. There's that pretty mark right there. Look at that beautiful coin. MS70. You know, I totaled it all up one day and just, oh, what do we got here? Another one. You guys don't believe me. Let me go back. I know somebody, oh, that's the same coin. There it is. You got to love it, man. So, two of them. Got another one, but it's not in the first strike. This is the Philadelphia. What else do I got? San Francisco first strike, MS70. My wife criticized me, like I said, for buying some of these coins and why do you do it? And I'm like, why? Because one day they're going to be worth a lot more than they are right now. I said, you know how much is in this case? <laughs> I said, between ten and $15,000 in value. And I bought them from the mint, most of them, except that first day of issue. Obviously, us as regular submitters or whatever, we cannot submit for first day of issue. It's got to be one of these, you know, large dealers, authorized purchasers, or the bulk purchasers that can do that. And then there's a San Francisco mint. Anyways, man, nice little gold case. I love it. Me and old Jake will go through this case for every once in a while, so I'll remind them. Not to sell them cheap one day. Anyways, what's next, man? What do you guys want to crack open? Did you guys see them Cowboys, man, on Thursday? They put a hurt on them Commanders. I still call them the Redskins, man. Come on. Now they want to go back to the name. A lot of people are saying. So I think personally that there should be no shame in that name. We should be honored. I mean, look at the Indian head pennies and every coin gold where we've recognized and um, paid homage to, to our Native Americans, man. I know we did them bad. Well, not we, you know, in, the, in those times. But anyways, I don't want to get all, you know, um, political or anything like that. But 
and Cowboys, hottest team in football right now. And we play the Dolphins soon. Yeah, next week. Right? No, it's Seahawks. Seahawks, and then the week after that, we're going to play the... Yeah, I think i got to bust this little label open. So I'll open up these packs. And we'll start with, oh, Tago, Tago Viola. Tago Viola. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Not dorking it up for my Pacific Islander brothers out there. So what do we have in this pack? It says, oh, I should have showed you guys. We got one 2021 Panini Dunruss Optic Pack, which is this one. Two Panini Select Draft Picks, which are this one and that one. And one Mystery Pack. Mystery. Wait a minute, what is this here? These are the Selects. Drafts. Now here's that's the mystery. All right, let's see what they got. So, go ahead and let these open right quick. Boom. I do it like this, man, because I like to see the wrapper. You know, I see these guys on some of these YouTube channels and they just mutilate the packaging, and I like to keep it. So, what do we have? Matt Ryan. He retired a few years ago. No, yeah, he was a quarterback for the Atlanta Hawks for a while, or Atlanta Falcons. Hmm, 28 28, Tom Brady came back, man. I'll always remember that. Good game. DeAndre Swift, he's still playing, man. Who's he with? Eagles, I think, running back? I think so. Jason Witten, man, one of the all time great tight ends for the Cowboys. And then I think he went and played for Oakland for a while. What do we have here? Select company. Chris Olav. Olav. Nick Boza and J.K. Dobbins. San Francisco 49ers, I think. Then you got Josh Jacobs. Everyone from Alabama, man, makes it to the pros. What they do when they win those bowl games. Anyways, man. Nothing special about that card. Got a couple few players. Uh, I want to get to this optics next. Now, let's open this one. Then. I'm not going to open this one. Too many cards in there. Uh, man, I'll just go through it really quick. Do I dork it up, man? Because I'm like trying to talk. and So if I mess up some of these dudes, put in the comments. Kyler Murray, he's back. Won his first game back from that ACL injury here in Arizona, man. Cardinals quarterback. Kayvon Tribodeau. Rookie card. How does he play for? I heard the name a lot, but anyways. Bailey Zappi. Hmm. Rookie card. It didn't go good for him for in um, New England, did it? But he still has some chance, a chance. Carson Strong and the En Fuego. And I don't think none of these are numbered. And then we got, again, Kayvon Tribido. Boy, is that the same guy in the same pack? Oh, that's his rookie card. Both rookie cards. Come on, man. Do something and I'll sleeve you up one day. So that's that one. Let's get to this value pack real quick. See what it's got. You got something to show other than base card. Trey McBride, Ahmad Gardner, Breeze Hall, rookie card, rookie card for this Trey McBride. John Elway, man, one of the Denver greats. Julio Jones, he's back. He's with the Eagles. DK Metcalf. I know he's still playing, right? Matthew Stafford, Rams, Super Bowl winner a few years ago, a couple years ago. Traylon Burks, Ugh, he was a rookie. Oh, Sam Howell. Mm, and Fuego, I like that card. 
unstoppable Drake Landon. Hey, Tom Brady, man. Boy, that would have been great if that was his rookie card. Man, I miss that guy. I miss hating him, really. Such a great player. Six, seven Super Bowls, man. That'll never be beat. Mike Williams. You know what I think with Tom Brady? They should have made a special exemption. As soon as he really retired, they should have just given him the gold jacket, man. And just had a special ceremony for him, man. That dude, just that good. Mike Williams, Nick Chubbs, he's still around playing. Sam Howell, he's at it, man. And then Peyton Manning, boy, that nephew, Arch Manning, finally played this weekend. Did pretty good, man. I think he scored a touchdown or two. Anyways, at that pack, let's get to this one. I think this is the one that has some good cards. Let's see what we got, guys. Come on. Get high all good one. Why not? It's Thanksgiving. Hmm, come on out here. What do we got? Chase Edmonds, running back Cardinals. Hmm. Man, he's probably still there. Jermaine Pratt for the Bengals. Got a rookie card anywhere, man? Come on. Antonio Gibson for the Redskins. What do we got here in this silver color? Oh, green with stars. Not sure what that's called, but that's Jalen Hurst, man. He's got the best record right now. Them Eagles, we're in the same division, boy. We're fighting for that first place, first round by in the NFC East. And the best record is going to come down to the wire. We'll see what happens, man. I know we have the talent. They got lucky by inches that game a couple weeks ago, and they barely put up that W. We got a number back here? No. That's the regular Jalen Hurst, but not regular. Got the stars. I'll look it up right now in the small print. I ain't going to bother you guys with it, but I'll definitely sleeve that one up just because it's a cool card. Maybe an Eagle fan out there and want it. Let me know, man, if you guys want this. Let me look up the value first. It's like one of those silver shimmers or whatever. Anyways, I, bro I busted out a few packs yesterday. I got these. Got a few numbered cards. There's another Joe Burrow. I got a lot of San Francisco. Where's that Brock Purdy? Who really likes that dude? Man, that dude's so hot right now. Uh, number to 399. And I'll just throw Jalen Hurst up there as an optic. Anyways, guys, that's that pack. I won't open that one for you guys, but let's get to some scratching. Now, my daughter, she never likes doing this stuff, but she said, tell me when you're going to scratch, and I want to I see that. So she's here. Come on over here, Mama. Say hi to everybody. This is Brio. <laughs> I got Jaco and Brio. Love. Which one? Which one? Which one should we scratch? Mm -hmm. The twenty-five days of winning, hundred times, went up to five hundred thousand, or do you want to go with the cash? Mm -hmm. Just because it's thirty bucks. Anyways, I got a twenty, a ten, and a thirty. All right, and of course we're gonna pick a lucky Walker. Like sure, go ahead. Make it a lucky one. Oh, listen to that silver. That's the one. All right. Well, we got a 1943 Philadelphia. All right. Let's do it. Make a little room because we're going to make a little mess here. Joe Burrow will open you later. All right. Here we go. Now, you get a... Cash bonus, reveal a $50, $100, or $500 prize in any of the three cash bonus spots. Win that prize instantly. Let's, let's be some instant winners. And I knew that was going to happen. That time was a little too soft. So, a little tagliavolia. Not to scratch on anybody. There we go. That's better. What does that say? Cash bonus. Ah, but that's a. 
lucky charm gotta be a number give me some numbers give me a number give me a number no a diamond now here's anything in the back sometimes they're in the back so now we just scratch these numbers off right here i take it let's zoom you in a little bit more got a 31 a 2 43 36 come on be lucky lady come on walking liberty and a 38 so we got 140 240s a single digit a teen and a few in the 30s now watch i'm gonna get a one a three a 13, a 15, a 41, a 43. Oh, no, I have 43s right there. And I'll probably get 50s and some crazy numbers. Watch. Always happens. Where do you want to start, Mom? At the bottom, the top, down this way, up? What do you want to do? You call it. Uh, want to go up from the bottom? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see what we got. 23. What do we got in the 20s? Nothing in the 20s. Every time I see a 2, I'm just going to... Oh, we got a three. Make it a one, six, a four, an eight. And it's a five. <laughs> I knew it. Oh, is that a regular two? Because we got a two there. Yeah! I see some zeros. Oh, we're in the money. I don't know what that is, but we'll come back to it. Yeah! These 30 bucks. <laughs> come on. What do we have here? 26? No, I don't have no 20s, right? Mm -mm. Oh, this is getting exciting. We got a 1. I told you we'd get a 1. But I said 1 or a 3. I didn't think on this 2, so... Not bad. Where? What row next? That one. This one up mm -hmm. or down? Alright, we'll go up. 15. I only got a 14. You see? I told you. No 10s. We got a no eight, we got a single digit on the two. Twenty-seven. No. Nope. Come on, baby. We got a one anywhere. Fourteen. Boom, it's a twelve. Nothing on that row, mama. Which one? Yeah. This one here? Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Come on. Give us another one. Give us another one. It's Thanksgiving. We got forties. We got a forty-three. Make it a three. Oh, 41. 20. We got a few options, don't we? Or nothing. Nothing in the 20s. Could it be just a 2? No, just a 20. Oh, another 28. Why don't it be a 38? 40. We're in the month now. As soon as I saw that zero. Come on, baby. Come on. One. Four. That's an 18, I think. Yeah. No, mama. Two rows left. Make them, make them count. Make them count. This one here? Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Sometimes this last one is like the winner, so. I've seen a lot of guys that, and not in this case. Mm -hmm. oh, we still got some hope. 21? Uh, yeah. nope. 31. Man, I hate when they do that. Three. What did I tell you? There's going to be a one and a three. Look. One, three. All right, what's next? Ah, uh, 11. Needed a 14. Six. No. Nope. All right, last one. I'll go from the top to the bottom on this one. Come on, baby. Come on. No 30s. No, we got 45. No. Nope. Doesn't sound familiar. Seven. I know not for sure. 24. No. We got no 20s. I forgot. Well, at least we got one winner. A 46, I hope. 10 bucks? No, the minimum should be 30, so. 50 bucks! Yeah! <laughs> we made. We made 20 bucks, man. You guys see that? Freaking awesome, man. Way to pick them. All right, we'll do one more, and then uh, we're already at. You want to do the $10 in the spirit of Christmas? It's coming up, guys. Wait a minute, what is this? I don't want this to be a long one. This 25 days of winning went up to 100,000 players. Scratch days one through 25. 
reveal a Santa symbol win prize shown for that day. Reveal a 10 by symbol to win 10 times the prize for that day. So where's day one up here? And it says, uh, I guess all you gotta do is reveal a Santa symbol. That's uh, not a Santa. No. Necklace. Globe. Nuggets. Lights. Come on, Santa. Go bar. Come on. That's what, that's what a stacker's needs. <laughs> Ha <laughs> piggy bank, man. Throw some more coins in that thing. Sweater. Ugly Christmas sweater. Give me a number. Or give me Santa's head. Give me Santa's head. Star. Freaking beanie. Mittens. Candy. Train. Lemon, yeah, that's what this ring, this card is, a lemon. Oh, wallet, man, come on. It's like you're hinting at me. Coffee, cappuccino, pot of gold. There you go, man, some silver in that thing. Come on. Come on, Santa. Give me some numbers. Give me a number. Fireplace, last one, guys. Boo. Under 25 days of winning. Any other ones in here? About the back. No, I was a complete bust on this one. Oh well. Uh well, we're at the 26 minute mark. What do you want to do? Last one or sorry guys, I'm tuned too much. Where's the other ticket, mama? Oh. Let's do this one real quick. Uh, some bonus. What does it say? Reveal a prize amount in the three bonus spot and win that amount instantly. Well, I guess it has to have a... No. It's hard to win on these, man. Although it's not impossible. 39, 41, 33. 39, 43, 38, 27, 26, 40... 17. Mm, I like the way they put them stacks up there. 28. 38. 35. Nope. 42. No, nope, we got a 43 and a 40. 17. Oh, we're a winner, Mama. Look. Oh, yeah. I don't know yet, but I got, I matched the numbers. This is another lucky one. 37. Nope, I got 27. We'll come back to that one. 21. I don't remember seeing that one. Four. Any single digits? No single digits. 31. Nope. Seven. No single digits. 15. No. Yeah, we got a 17, obviously. 44. Nope. One. No single digits. 32, we got a 38 and a 39, and a 40. 30, I knew it. 46, no. 12, 23, 47, 25, 49. Come on, give me one more. Give us another one. Brio needs a new pair of shoes. <laughs> 13. Let him look 13. What I got? 14. I don't know. All I got was that. Just a 17. Oh, well. Let's see what we got, guys. Let me see if I can bring you in there and all this light shimmering. Maybe it's going to be a freaking $500,000. Ready? Pay my mortgage, baby. Pay my mortgage. Oh, 20 bucks. Man, I hate that. You spend 20. 
and you win 20. Now I'll double check it. Sometimes I miss a couple when I go scan them, it comes out with a little bit more. Anyways, guys, I'll open these up later. Let me know if you guys want me to open these up, maybe in another video. Hope you like you guys like this video, man. I uh, these are some of the things I like to do, especially on the weekends. Do some scratches, check out some cards, do a little coin roll hunting, and you know, look at my previous submissions. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know what you think. Like, share, you know the routine. Anyways, I'll come back with another one. I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I hope you thank the good man up above for the blessings that he has given us. And many, many more. Enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Hi-yo. And Brio out.